Millions of Americans will be watching on Monday for the total eclipse. We are, as you can see, three days, 20 hours, and about uh, 24 minutes or so away from the big event. Of course, you can only look at the eclipse, though, with the use of specialized eye protection. We can't repeat that enough for solar yeah, viewing. Don't want to hurt your vision. Right. Our Ashley Barrissey will be traveling to Cleveland Monday to experience totality. She spoke with an expert at the University of Michigan who puts into perspective how different the experience will be in the path of totality. The path of totality is very narrow. It's only about 100 miles wide. Luna Pier is the only spot in Michigan that will fall in that path, reaching totality around 3.15 p.m. Professor Gertis at the University of Michigan explains what you experience while in totality. It will be about as dark as it gets, maybe like 45 minutes after sunset. The difference is, after sunset, you see twilight colors only in the west. But during a total eclipse, you see the colors of twilight 360 degrees around the horizon as we're standing in the center of the moon's shadow and, and the region uh, outside of that is, is uh, still in light. Not to mention, animals will start their nighttime rituals. Nocturnal wildlife may awaken while non-nocturnal creatures may think it's time for bed. You will not only see a difference, you will feel a difference too. That's because temperatures can drop by several degrees. A good portion of the rest of Michigan will be closer to 99% total coverage, but even that 1% makes a difference. That's because 1% of the sun's light is about 400 times brighter than the full moon. The difference between a 99% partial eclipse and a total eclipse is kind of like the difference between driving to Ford Field from some distance away and staying right outside the stadium. You got 99% of the way there, and then you hear the Lions win the game on the last play. The crowd goes nuts. You know something exciting happened. It was You were close enough for it to be interesting, but it's nothing like the experience of being inside and watching it. Being 99% partial is the same kind of a thing. If you can get into that path of totality just an hour or so away from here, make the effort to do it. The next eclipse that will be visible from a good swath of the continental United States won't happen until the year 2044, so 20 years from now. And the next eclipse that's visible from Michigan won't happen until 2099. However, the next total eclipse will happen in August of 2026, and it will be visible off the coast of Iceland, England, finally making landfall near Spain. So maybe now is the time to start planning a trip overseas. Okay, Ashley, and you can see Ashley's full interview on the eclipse right now on our website. We'll be streaming live all day on Local 4 Plus and click on Detroit.com with reports from Cleveland, Toledo, and Luna Pier. Plus, we'll be talking to NASA astronauts and scientists about this event as it happens.